Hi everybody, it's Kim from Expressions of the Universe with your weekly wisdom for December 16th through December 22nd of 2018. And it's our last week of the Sun in Sagittarius. Capricorn's going to be coming in. We have the Winter Solstice and Yule, which is my favorite. And we also have a full moon in Cancer at zero degrees. So let's get started. Do not delay. I need to make this quick. You'll see that I have cards down here. I'm getting ready to do a pull your own for winter solstice and the new year. There are a lot of cards here. There's 27. I am going to post a picture um, so that you can pick your card and then I will do the reading. They are all major arcana cards and all four aces for new beginnings. So let's see what I have in my little black bag. <clears throat> and I hope it's a goodie. Okay, I can't even read it. Oh, it's expectancy. Hmm, that's interesting. And is that a stocking? Kind of makes me think of the holidays and the things that we're expecting. But the first thing that comes to my mind when I see expectancy is that when we expect things to be a certain way, we often wind up being disappointed. Because a lot of times things don't turn out the way that we want them to. So for me, I try not to put any expectations on people and situations and things because you never know what you're going to get and if you don't put expectations on people and things and situations then you don't generally don't wind up disappointed so that's what I'm getting from that the stone that I'm using this week is moonstone and it says magic on it because this is an extremely magical week at least for me because I celebrate you all I celebrate winter solstice that is my holiday season I know many of you celebrate Christmas Hanukkah Kwanzaa during this time of year but to me the winter solstice and Yule uh, being from German heritage, that is the most special time for me. And that's on December 21st. Then we do have the full moon in Cancer on next Saturday, December 22nd. I'm getting ready to slow it down for myself. So that's why I'm going to do this spread for all of you. Not in this video. This will be a separate video. Um... And then I'm going to probably call it quits for the rest of this year so that I could take a little bit of a break for myself. So, and I was trying to pause this video and it's not working. And I am back. So let's get started on the cards. I really only wanted to pull one card for the week because time is not allowing me to post these to Facebook and Instagram every single day. But when I was shuffling, of course, more than one card fell out. And the first card that is coming up is Higher Power. And this week really gives me the feeling of a higher power. This week is all about believing, believing in the magic, believing in our own selves, believing in our beliefs without pushing them onto other people. Um, and I don't want to say that over and over again, but that's how I feel. And it's, I just saw this big, huge sign the other day and it was believe and it was inside of a Macy's I never go into a mall maybe once a year during this time looking for something special and I just felt like my mom was with me and then her favorite Christmas song came on 
O Holy Night. And I, I smiled and then I took 10 more steps and I saw this big thing, Believe, after I thought to myself, are you with me? And so, you know, I believed that she was. It felt like her. Magical things happen at this time of year. And all you have to do is believe that they could be true. Put those wishes out, especially this week with winter solstice and that full moon. You have to put the wishes out there. But this full moon that's coming in on the 22nd is really reminiscent to me of the things that we need to get rid of before the new year. It is the full cold moon. It is at zero degrees cancer. It's all about the home and nurturing and being with our family. So it's no surprise that these two cards popped out of the deck with higher power and it is no place like home and the tribe. The no place like home shows up reminding us this is where our hearts belong and our home could be just a state of mind it could be something within ourselves but no place like home also tells me that no matter where you run to no matter you know what you try and get away from there's still no place like home and this could be a memory this could be creating a tradition but it says to be with your family and you know nurture and love them and be appreciative of what you have in your own home you don't have to look outside of yourself you don't have to have the best of anything or the biggest of anything or the most of anything all you have to do is be loved and comforted within that home and then i have the tribe and this really kind of says it all because can you see that the tribe uh, this card always tells me to not only find your tribe to be with your tribe be with the people that share your beliefs be with the people that share your love and this is where you'll thrive is within your tribe and I think you know with this 2018 being so wonky a lot of us were looking for our tribe I think also too going into the new year we will be finding our tribe and or discovering that maybe some people that are already in your life are already part of your tribe we're also going to discover with this winter solstice and this full moon following that certain people in your life that are currently there possibly could not be part of your tribe and you have to be willing to walk away from what isn't serving you and the people that aren't fully working uh, to your benefit you know who are your closest allies who are the people that always have your back who are the people that you can t telepathically communicate with who are the people that get you that's really what we have to focus on and a lot of times it is our family or our closest friends um, and sometimes it's just ourselves so that's really all I have for all of you for this week I'm keeping it short and sweet so that I can do this spread for all of you for the winter solstice and the new year so you'll pick a card and I'll tell you what you have coming for for the next year so until then keep a lookout for this video I guess this is possibly my end of the year address because I do want to spend some time with my tribe and my family and be all comfy cozy in my home and not be running around and you know being crazy out in the world and I just want to rest and enjoy and that's what you should all do too so until next time see you later thank you for watching if you like this video please share it with your friends I love to see your likes and comments they it just thrills me when someone likes my video or comments on it 
And um, I guess that's it. Peace and blessings and happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Kwanzaa. Happy New Year.